Hello and good evening. My name is John. We're here playing Deliver Us the Moon as part of my Steam Cleaning series where I go through every game in my Steam library eventually and then arbitrarily rate and or review them after we had a playtime. I don't quite know what the game is, but the game is out at random. Resources seemed endless. The 1990s. But in 2030, the great right. energy crisis began. With hardly any resources left on our world, global powers created the World Space Agency. <gasps> What's up? For <clears throat> the answer was found in Helium 3. Oh. A powerful isotope discovered in abundance on the moon. With it, humanity could satisfy its energy demand for decades to come. Great, but and so in 2032, mankind colonized the moon, spearheaded by the Lunar Council. The WSA constructed several permanent settlements to harvest and process helium three. They don't like that permanent. The resulting energy was transferred to Earth through a revolutionary energy network, the Microwave Power Transmission, or MPT. Yeah, that probably could have never go wrong. All seemed well. Fateful night in 2054, the lights went out. No energy. The MPT had gone offline, and communication with the lunar colonists was lost. Without earthly resources to launch a full-scale rescue mission to the moon, the World Space Agency was shut down permanently. Hey, what? In 2055. Yeah, no redundancies. But a small group of former WSA colonists refused to accept humanity's bleak future. Determined to discover the colony's fate and to restore the MPT, they've been preparing their mission in an abandoned desert launch facility. Now, in 2059, they are ready to launch an astronaut to the moon. What awaits is unknown and unforeseeable, but the mission is clear. Deliver us. The moon. The moon. Haunted. Always has been. That neck piece looked a little <laughs> enclosed. All right, let's say new game. Yeah, my Steam playing series. Got a game in my Steam library eventually. Then I'll actually rate and read them, but that will be the time. I do not know what this game is, but these games are out at random. So let's hop in together and find out what this game has to offer. The missing lunar colonists gather all around the world tonight in remembrance of the 2054 MPT blackout that resulted in a global power outage and the loss of contact with the lunar colony. The blackout caused global turmoil, which ultimately led to the closure of the world. So someone printed a newspaper and got it to the moon? The recent formation of the largest dust storm on record has prompted climatologists to readjust their forecast of the equatorial desert's growth rate. As a result of the new storm, the desert has soon covered 30% of the globe's landmass. Several governments have pledged support for refugees despite reports of resource shortages. The dust storm is expected to hit residential zones between oh. the northern 40th F. and 50th latitude lines by late afternoon and pass over the World Space Agency. Very shiny magazine. All right, settings. Everything just looks really, the UI looks really big. Alright, uh, after back. Authorities have imposed a mandatory evacuation of the impacted areas. For countries north of the equatorial desert, temperatures are expected to be a mild. You can do it. Thanks, Claire. This was Nicole Tina, are you there? September 16, 2059. Wishing you a safe and happy day. Get in the suit. No reflection on my face. Ground control to Fortuna One. This is Claire. Please confirm radio contact. Hi, Claire. Tab Astral Tool. Welcome. Radio contact confirmed. <laughs> Make your way to the launch platform and prime the rocket for lift. Oh. We have to launch before the dust storm hits. We're going to the moon. Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. Five years after the blackout. There she is, the Taurus 5. <clears throat> Four years to get her ready for launch. But you need to hurry. The dust storm will hit this area 
area in a few hours. If we don't succeed now, the Fortuna mission will be over for good. Okay, we put our spaceship on a little early. Scannable information. Should I be sprinting in a spacesuit? All right, so it goes into first person here. That's kind of cool. Oh, hold on. Some sort of shrine. Not a bad transition between first and third. A little bit void of other people. Dunk. Oh, bummer. We must tutorialize before we go to the moon. I can jump. Oh, all right. Boom, 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 boom. Wait a second. Why do I have a Fortuna, Fortuna 1 badge for Taurus 5 ship? Fortuna 1, when I'm riding the Taurus 5. Get your badges right. Donk. Oh, the dust storm is coming. Good question. It's a one person journey. There's no light switch? Guess we have no power. Uh, one, one, two, three, four. Uh, I'm all out of ideas. Three, five, four, eight. Three, five, four, eight. Well, if the power is out, how's that pad working? Pull. Oh. Alright, I got some, get some out exterior lights showing. Desert desertification. Some sort of drone. All right. Okay. We sure have a lot of miscellaneous tasks to get to the the ship launch. Oh. I always have my flashlight on. I was actually a power meter in my backpack with a flashlight. Why? Why you choose to do that? Nope. Fortuna one is a go. I, I don't know what this means. Blackout. One, the transmitter 
right there. Pizza space. Claire, there you are. Come on, we're celebrating in the other room. Everyone is looking for you. I need to go over this one last time, Maria. We've been over it before multiple times. Uh -huh. We're good. Come. It's time to join the party. It won't take long. I'll be right there. A true Johansson. Once he set his mind to something, I could never convince him either. You are just as stubborn as your father. Kids, you're in the control center. Get the rocket ready to launch as fast as possible. Reboot. Calculating new storm ETA. So it's definitely a narrative storytelling. You know, we're going on rails more or less, going through the environment. Oh, I got a puzzle here. Keep going, Fortuna. We've been working too long to give up now. Close both fuel valves. All right. Alright. There's one. Like, there's a mystery, obviously, of, like, why did the moon stop sending power back to the Earth? As far as the warm-up for it, if the moon was about... The sh it's about getting to the moon. I'm sure there's a lot of time spent... Oh, no. Oh no. Well, it's a good thing there was a movable ladder somewhere. Bump. Like, I want to be on the moon solving moon mysteries. F. 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 Like, why would you put me in my spacesuit this early in the process? Mystery solved. It's a lot for one person to do, you know? Alright, now we can turn the key. Hey, that's those fuel valves. Turn the key. <clears throat> Wait, shouldn't I be up there? All right, we run back up. I'm trying. I, I, I really want to let the timer run down, but let's not. You have a really weird slide to your movement. Oh, uh, why did I, we only staff this with one person? The music is swelling. All right, we're in cinematic mode. We made it. Look at navigation systems online. When you believe in it. Just like your training, you can do this. 
I can do this. Green. What? A1, A3, B3, B4. It's a good thing there's, there's notes. Okay. Okay, what? Sound suppression? Okay. Oh, it's all there. Let's do it. Three, two. I mean, they did turn on the sound suppression system. The fact that I can just move my head around a lot, it's a little... Oh man, we didn't turn the wipers on. To do this too. Hooray, we're on our way to the moon. Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. If you want to take a trip, climb aboard my rocket ship. If I had a better window, this would be more. There's a window there. Earth, the pale blue dots. Ah. Dust to dust. I mean, we had a pretty good run. You'll need to find the MPT transmitter at the Pearson space station. From there, the power signal was relayed to Earth. This was the final link in the MPT network before the blackout. If there are answers to find, they're at Pearson, clear. <laughs> we need to head down to the shelter. These winds are getting bad. Understood. For Tuna 1, this storm is going to jam radio contact. You'll be on your own for a while. Oh no, my oxygen. Remember me? Hey, what? Raymond? I don't know. This should have all been... Wait, if there's oxygen canisters, am I going to have to be hunted for canisters? Oh! We made it. I got my blue to doop for an achievement for reaching, reaching the moon. Which I haven't quite done yet, but I assume post cutscene I'll have mooned. Oh, is that what a late title card? 20 minutes in? You kidding me? I mean, I'll do like a late title card. I'm not, I'm not being too mean here. Boop. I mean, it's such a big energy laser, like it almost touches Earth. 
Wait, I'm not at the moon. I'm at the base. Ugh. At the park it? Oh, control moves down. Nailed it. <clears throat> Perfect parking. Space movement feels fine. Oxygen depleting. Bring life support back on. Yeah, that sounds right. Okay. You know, a commentary like, oh, you just grabbed a blah de blah. It'll help you open the blah de blah. Not of power. Okay. Okay. These space batteries. Very useful. Where's the other space battery I need? Hate the one out of this doorway? Uh, no, I can't. Hmm. Ah. Uh. It's 
real space balls up here with just canisters of oxygen sitting around. Not like a lot of oxygen, just like the smallest amount, like a little nibble. Is there another door over here? All right. Oh, I see. It goes here. I can grab this one. Pull it out. Put it in. Then go back and grab this one. Pull it out. Did I do it? Oh, I gotta reboot. Look at us. Uh, how do I? What's how do I do? need any more oxygen. Uh, I'm gonna pull those out. Can't, that screen's dead to me. Hmm. What am I missing in my navigation of this space? Oh, below this open. All right. And the audio log. Copy. copy control, we're all set. Ready for descent. The MPT network is still down, so expect the lights to go out as you descend towards Copernicus. Thanks for the heads up, Pearson. I'm not the first person to try. We hear you, Control. Rolf, you ready? I am. And don't worry, Control. It's probably just a glitch. We'll be back before you know it. Let's find out how they've been holding up down there. Oof. Alex, that is a rough exterior texture. Pull more of those? Doing something. Don't know what. Popping some lid off of something. Is this where I went in? Ugh. It's very hard to navigate this space. Right, so I came down. I went through here. Hey, no, that's right. All right. Oh, there's a computer. 
you know. Then I went around. So if I see a tunnel or a passageway outside of this, I can take it. All right, so like this here. I guess that sound effect is like my jets or something. Roll over on the floor. Oh, I'm so low on the ground. Rolf's room. Earth. Uh, anything else in here, Rolf? Not really. Sarah Baker's room. before we head down are you bringing that thing along of course two we'll five three nine it. besides you wouldn't have made it to that airlock if it hadn't been for him <sighs> this mpt blackout can't be just a glitch rolf everything is still dark down there last time there was an outage <sighs> did you hear the message from earth no what did they say? They can't even send ships up here anymore without the MPT. It's crazy, right? We're the only ones able to investigate the blackout. Sarah, we need to get you guys down to the surface ASAP. We don't have much time. <sighs> okay, let's go. Uh, airlock? Alright. Well, I have to say, this is an interesting uh, premise and setup for it. Um, the pacing's a little bit slow, which I'm sure is, you know, obviously intentional. Um, I feel like I would like to get to the moon a little faster. But that's probably where the, the finale is. Um, Sarah's workstation. It's also not, like, super great at signaling goals central mainframe here okay not established no moon hub connection rotate Everything's broken. All right. This has been uh, Deliver Us the Moon. Um, it, it's a, well, it's a pretty interesting, like I said, walking sim narrative exploration stuff. Um, but it's going at a pretty slow pace. So I think I'm, I'm done for here. Hold on. Also funny how low on the ground I am. Oh. Cut my locks here. Oh. Pro gamer. And then I need to to go outside. It's the other other location, I think. Could be wrong. And then I'll have oxygen limited, yeah.
I got a cutting laser tool. Alright. Well, you don't just don't just weigh that around. I don't know if I fully agree with this. But they're adding some mechanics on, which is nice. I mean, eight hardship space, hard space shipbreaker, but you know they do what they can. All right, all right. I mean, this is. Do you want to open the O2 box? It's just a nice big chunk of O2 outside. I'm doing some lasting damage. Thank God it's not sealed on the other side. Zap, zap, zap. Yeah, I'm good. Nailed it. All right. Copy that. Do you think we'll finish construction anytime soon? Uh, was the council claiming more supplies each week? I doubt it. I'm surprised we got this past MacArthur in the first place. I kind of prefer gravity back. Hey, listen, I'm getting strange readings here from the lunar surface. Are you seeing anything? Just wrapping up. What the hell? What the hell? All the lights are shutting down. Are you alright, Bob? What just happened? I can't see a thing. Everything is dark out here. We lost power from the MPT. The whole station is down. Can you find your way back to the airlock? Negative. I don't have a visual. Right. I'm sending Alex to block the airlock doors. Do you see him? I see his flashlight. Heading back to the airlock. What's going on? What is Alex? What robot buddy is that? Got a welding helmet. Gotta fly through the electrified space. Cut the power. That looks like it's gonna cause lasting damage. All right, deliver us the moon. I, I think it's pretty cool. Um, I'm glad that they're changing up mechanics uh, frequently enough, even though it is a little slow. What is this? Oh, well, it's water probably. All right, yeah. Oh no, <laughs> cheers. <laughs> 